Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing an unboxing of a uh, mini camp stove or wood burning stove, um, the uh, guide gear. And uh, so we'll see what we've got here. Just received this yesterday. Uh, okay, made in China. Not crazy about that. This thing does have some weight to it. It is pretty heavy. All right. Very heavy. Okay, everything is inside the stove looks as good not a lot of little parts I'd have to check the weight on that but this is a lot better than I thought the door is cast iron and it does have a uh, oh, but this is a little bit better than what I was expecting. Got a uh, a coal rake or for the ashes, for the embers. Everything is wrapped up pretty good. You know what? This is not. I just came from Lowe's and was looking at some three and four inch pipe and that is very thin metal. This is, I don't know if you could see how thick that is, but this is solid, solid steel. I'm impressed with that. Looks like we've got some screws here, probably for the legs. This looks like probably the Um, pipe. All right. I'm assuming this is another, probably to scrape or move the logs around. Some more pipe. I have to tell you guys, I'm, I am actually very, very, very happy. This is, uh, this isn't just a cheap little stove. I didn't pay much. I did. I ended up getting it on Amazon. It, the regular price is $159, but uh, I ended up. I have a company. Oh, look at that! Now that's a good quality handle. I had a uh, couple of credits on there, and so it ended up not costing me anything. Here is the stove with the damper. More pipe. And this is going to be the, the top of the, the pipe. Stop any uh, sparks. One of the legs. The legs very sturdy. This front of it is steel plate. And I'm actually pleasantly surprised. And this probably will fit a uh, maybe a 12, 15 inch log. I'll double check that for you. I'm going to go ahead and assemble this, but from what I see, that this is actually a great little stove. I would highly recommend it. Um, your little air dampers on the front. Let me go ahead and I'm going to put this together, uh, and I'll show you what it looks like assembled. There are racks and some accessories that you can buy and put on here, so if you wanted to put some pots or... Uh, Maybe even um, some gloves or mittens that are, are wet during the winter. 
But um, let me put this together and I will show you what it looks like. All right, I'll get right back to you. Okay guys, welcome back. Put this together. It was very easy. There's uh, four legs and there's two uh, bolts for each leg. And that just, it's tapped in the bottom so you just tighten those up. Uh, you can use a, a uh, hex nut or a, a uh, Allen wrench or uh, I ended up going to a socket. The uh, starter uh, pipe uh, goes from underneath and that's threaded and then um, I've only put a couple of pipes on but there's actually three more pipes that go on there the door door handle very very easy and it's got a little spring and you just spring loaded and I want to show you something this is a 16 inch log no problem fitting that in I wish that there was a grate that goes in here um, I think that's part of the accessories that you can buy um, so I'll probably end up getting a grate at some point otherwise I'm just going to leave some ash in the bottom of that uh, to protect the bottom um, but I probably will end up putting in some type of small little grate there's not a lot of room you probably could fit uh, maybe three logs in there uh, two very easily so the first thing that I would suggest is when you do go ahead and start a fire in here do this outside you want to burn off any of the chemicals any of the the uh, uh, oils that are on the outside of the uh, stove so I would burn that off first with a good burn and do that outside but it's very sturdy very heavy um, I'm really impressed I, I really thought it wasn't going to be very good or something that's not going to hold up, but <clears throat> it actually is made very, very well. So, uh, hope you enjoyed this video and hope you got some information from it. All right, we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.